Right, so today we're going to be showing you how we prepare a medium three bird roast uh, for your Christmas dinner. This will feed 10 to 12 people. Yeah, ish, minimum. Yeah. Probably a bit more, but. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we so, have, first off, turkey breast. Whole turkey breast. Yeah, well, one side of a turkey breast. Yeah. 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 Duck breast. Okay. Chicken breast, duck breast. We're not going to put all these in. We're putting one and a half in these. Okay. That that would go in a whole one that we do. That's the four kilo that would feed 15, 17. Okay. But what we're we're gonna oh, we're gonna do one and a half chicken breasts. And that's the bit of duck we cut. And one and a half duck breasts. That's what's going to go in along with three hundred and fifty grams of stuffing. Okay. And then the smoked streaky bacon on the top. Perfect. Which is all going to go in there. Okay. Yeah? So we do a smaller one, which we tend to do off of that end of the breast, and that will just have one chicken breast, one duck breast, and 250 grams of stuffing. Yeah, so, right. So trim this first. It's all some sort of like, this is a shaving of the breastbone that we we'll take off. That's a, hear it? Yeah. Wouldn't want to be eating that. A little bit left on there that off as well apart from that that's all the there is a bid in there by the way <laughs> um yeah the, apart from that that's all everything's all okay it's just a visual thing like there's a, a, a vein archery thing that goes down there just got to be able to find it so which i can't at the moment uh oh, hang on there it is yeah you all right there dove <laughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> So it's, it's amazing the audiences this grabs. So as you can see it there, look, if you don't get that out, it doesn't do any harm, it just, um, people think it isn't cooked, because no matter how much you cook it, that like blood vein, just here it is here. I mean, it's stronger in others than it is. If you don't get that out, when you carve it, it's all red, and everyone thinks, oh, it's not cooked, it's not cooked, which it is. Right, so we're then gonna cut this, pull that bit back and cut that there and we're gonna make it out of this end here and cut through there and we'll put that o right over there, there. <laughs> then we've got to cut two pockets to get this in so we put the smaller lot in there so we're gonna cut across here like that peeling it all the way down but not all the way so we go all the way through because otherwise it'll all come out the side there and then cut <laughs> <Such a child. laughs> So I'm going to cut a bigger one here, or the, the bigger flap, um, <laughs> so, so, um, oh, as, it, as it were. It's, it, it's all about flaps in this game. You've got a, a smaller one there and a bigger one there. Um, <laughs> so, oh my goodness. We're after nine o'clock watershed, haven't we? <laughs> right, so what we do is we have a, a layer of stuff. We get our 350 grams of stuff and we're spreading that amongst the free bird rice. So like I say, this is the smaller pocket, or flap. So you put the, that way we leave the skin on because that helps with all the flavors. So you put that in there, so you've got a layer of stuffing and layer of meat. Then you get another bit of stuffing. And layer that across there, like that. And you get your half chicken breast there. In fact, we could actually open that up a bit like that. And that will see how it sits better on there like that. So that's less. So that'll be in a minute like that. So now open this bit up here and do the same again. I wish I was watching this. <laughs> <laughs> so the um, reason why we deal with it in flaps is yeah. so that when you carve it, it all comes. You get a bit Through of everything. Nice and neatly. Yeah. It looks yeah. good on the table. Yeah, because then we've got the turkey separating that lot as well. So okay. we've got that lot. We try and get as much stuff as we can in the middle so it doesn't fall out, but you can't always do that. So in other words, I've managed to get all the stuffing layered. I'm going to have something covering it, like that chicken breast there. Right, so it's all in there. It's just a matter of folding it around, turning it over. Like so. Hopefully it'll stay nice and still. Then we get our mind of smoke streaky bacon. Let's 
it's um, so you know, it's, it, it, it's all gone quiet. I don't it's know quite what to say. I don't know quite not. what to say about putting bacon on the top. But, um, <laughs> you know, it is not really. I mean, you know, I've layered it perfectly. You know, one end to the other. To and, be to be fair you know. though, I've recently gone into other butchers to have a little look, and I am quite impressed with the way that ours looks. Oh, thank you. On the top, because yeah. a lot of the bacon is either quite fatty or there's not very much of it. Yeah. Well, fat doesn't bother me, but um, it's good for flavour. Yeah. So but you don't want to put too many people. strings around it. you just got to put enough to hold it still because you can't pull this very tight because otherwise it will skew with all over the place. Uh, get one and there. And that just pinch that there. Really? <laughs> Yeah, um, borrow someone's knife. Right. Notice it cut through the meat, so how uh, tender the meat was, though, didn't it? It went through that, no Yeah, problem. we didn't cut the yeah, string. Yeah, shows how tender the meat is, really, doesn't it? So, so I can fit in that gap. Yeah, yeah. So we've got that one there. It's starting to take shape, isn't it? See how? See, like oh, that steel in the knife worked, didn't it? Yeah. So then, then we turn it around that way, and uh, to stop, just in case they're trying to escape out the side, we put two strings that way. These then go towards the next half size free bird roast, but obviously for that we need we need an ordered in numericals of three, I believe, isn't it? <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. So, yeah, so all to your customers, yeah, so if you could all make sure that you order three, yeah, or <laughs> yeah. we'll get together with your friends because otherwise it's uh, no, it's not, it's two, isn't it? Twos. Yeah, two. Yeah, use that. Yeah, that's yeah, my one and a half for you. And each. Yeah. Jeez, <laughs> What's your change if you're coming here? Right? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. So, so, yeah, so you only want even numbers ordered, please. <laughs> uh, otherwise, we end up with half a duck breast and half a chicken breast. That's like, no use to anyone. It's your Christmas dinner, Charlie. Yeah, is it? You're so generous. Yeah. Right, this is the last string, and then that's it. It's job done. Okay, so the three bird roast, this is the medium one. Yeah, medium, uh, So half, we do small ones, which will feed five, five to seven. seven. Yeah. This medium one, which will feed 10 to 12. Yeah. And then we do a whole one, and which see, Now you feed. can pick it up, you don't have to be careful how you handle it and all that sort of thing. You just put it in your foil, wrap it around, cover it over with foil. It stops the bacon burning. And cooking instructions will be on your receipt. Okay. But, uh, That's it. Thank is that you. Yeah, do you want to whack on the scales or not? Yeah, if you want to. What? Here we go. No. Yeah. Um, cut and then we'll put it on the scales. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs>